is born of the flesh is flesh. That which is born of the flesh is flesh. Anytime you've been baptized in water in the name of Jesus Christ, and you call it for your flesh, that's no baptism. John 15 and 17. These things I command you, that you love one another. Love one another. Read on. If the world hates you, thank God, that he knows that it hates, hated me before it hated you. If you chose it, you can't help it, you're not. So I do. Some folks have so much trouble. Every time they tell me they have trouble, why are you having trouble? Because you chose it. And things ain't going to line up for you right when you do what God told you. Christ. Well, you may hear the word of God rightly divided, that is, in truth, unto the saving of the soul. Amen. Amen. We like to say greetings from the church, not a church, not first church, but the church. Right. In the name of Jesus Christ. The only place wherewith one can save his soul from this untoward generation. Yes. We do thank God for all of our listeners here and abroad. Wherever you may be listening, we thank God for you. Amen. May God ever bless you that you ever continue to listen, that you may save your soul from this untoward generation. Right. Amen. We thank God for all of his long suffering towards us, Lord. Yes, sir. Thank God for his keeping power. We thank God for every backbiter, pretender, whoever you may be, we forward. That is to give God the thanks and the glory for all things in the name of Jesus Christ. Right. But most of all, we thank God for they of the household of faith. All the saints of the Most High God. Yes. Here and abroad. Amen. Amen. That's right. Amen. We like to say, except the Lord build the house. Yes. Amen. Yes. Right. They labor in vain and build it. All your labors in vain except God do it. Right. Amen. You know, when my Lord was here, he left here in the book of Acts. He was here and he was with the apostles, Acts 1 and 9. And some like to say, after the resurrection, after his resurrection, when the saints got up, some like to say that they went back with him. Well, ain't nobody went to heaven. We all are waiting on the Lord's return, whether dead or alive. Amen. Right. He's the only one that ascended back up. With it says. Amen. And when he had spoken these things. Yeah. While they beheld. Yeah. He was taken up. Who, who was that? He was taken up. He was taken up. Meaning he ascended. Yes. You understand that? Amen. Yes, sir. I mean, he ascended. What it says. And a cloud received him out of their sight. So the. The one Lord Jesus Christ was taken up. Yes. And the Bible said a cloud received him. How? Out of their sight. Now while the book says no man ever sent it up to heaven. Right. But he that came down from heaven, right. even the son of man which is in heaven. Yes. So the son of man came down without a body. Yes. But ascended back to heaven with a body. Glory yes. to God. Hmm? Yes, sir. That's called victory. Amen. That's what that's called. That's called victory. Mm. My God in Jesus Christ. Amen. That's what I'm looking for. The same victory. Right. Immortality. Right. Hmm? Amen. Read. And while they looked steadfastly toward heaven uh -huh. as he went up, yeah. behold. Two men stood by in white apparel, yeah. which also said, 
ye men of Galilee, yeah. why stand ye gazing up into heaven? Why are you looking up into heaven? This same Jesus. See, people don't know who the same Jesus is. That's, right. That's the truth. Amen. They think the same Jesus means the body. Right. Hmm? They sure do. He said, same Jesus, yesterday and forevermore. Yeah. He's the Lord of God, I change not. Amen. That's the same Jesus. Yes. The one that don't change. Right. She, immortality don't change. That's why he got the victory. Yes. See, a mortal body changes. Yes, sir, it does. It changes with attitude. Mm -hmm. yep. It changes with age. Yes. It changes in the sun. Amen. Yes. Amen. But immortality Amen. don't change. Amen. Amen. Therefore, because our God came down and put on a body, got the victory in that body, left that body, went down into the heart of the earth, it came up. Yes. Right. My God with immortality. Amen. Yes, he did. Now that body is like unto the Son of Man now. That's what that means. When John said, I saw one like unto the Son of Man. Yes. Well, the Son of Man is eternal. Yes. Came sir. from heaven, went back to heaven. But he put on something that could be like unto him. Right. See, this natural body is not like unto my spirit. You understand? Mm -hmm. I have a spirit within me that is eternal. In this body house of clay you see is not likened to it. No. Mm -hmm. That's why they're at enmity with one another. Right. That's why they war. Why? Because the spirit is eternal and the outward man isn't. Right. That's your war. Your war is that your outward man is temporal. Right. And your inward man is eternal. Right. Ain't that some kind Amen. of fight? That's Amen. a fight there, my God. That's a fight right there. Yeah, it is. Ah, uh, that's a fight, I say. Amen. Hmm? Amen. I say that your outward man is temporal. Amen. And your inward man is eternal. Yes. Hmm? Huh? That's the truth. Amen. Am I right? Yes, Amen. sir. That's the wall. Right. I say that is the wall. Yes, it is. It is. So Jesus Christ, the victorious God that he is, King of kings, Lord of lords, which never lost a battle. Amen. Amen. Came down here and put on a body. Yes. And got yes. the victory. Yes. Amen. That's right. Mm. Yes, sir. The body he put on was not like him. It was against him. Right. Uh, right. I said the body that he put on out of Mary was not like him. It was against him. Mm -hmm. But the body that he put on from the dead yeah. was just like him. Amen. Yes. Eternal. Amen. Never died. Yes. Ranged throughout eternity. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. That's why it was like unto him. Let's see what the immortal body looks like. Revelations 1. In 9, 10, 11, 12, what it says. Amen. Let's see what immortality looked like. What it says. I was in the, 1 and 10. What it says. I was in the spirit on the Lord's day. Glory to God. What Amen. day is that? Amen. Where no time is. Amen. <laughs> Say, what Lord. day is that? Where no time is. Amen. Say, what is the Lord's day where no time is? Amen. <laughs> That's why he told her, the thief on the cross this day. Hmm? There's no time. Right. Hmm? Amen. God was talking out of time. Mm. Hmm? Yes, he couldn't sir. say, what, what, when you leave here, when you leave this side, what is it then? Hmm. This day. You don't have no Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. No, sir. You ain't got no 1 o'clock, 2 o'clock, 3 o'clock, 4 o'clock house rock. Right. So what you got this day? Mm. Uh, oh, Jesus. Amen. Read on. I was in the spirit on the, on the Lord's day. I was in the spirit on the Lord's day. 
And heard behind me a great voice. Heard behind me a great voice. As a, of a trumpet. As a what? As of a trumpet. Read on. Saying, I am Alpha and Omega. God was talking to him. Amen. Yes. John heard God talking. Amen. You see that? Yeah. He, he, he was in the Lord's, he was in the spirit on the Lord's day. He didn't know where it was coming from, but he heard a voice. Right. What it says? Saying, I am Alpha and Omega. That's God talking to John. Yes. Read on. The first and the last. That's God. Amen. Read. And what thou seest, write in a book and send it unto the seven churches which are, at, which are in Asia, unto Ephesus, and unto Smyrna, and unto Pergamos, and unto Thyatira, and unto Sardis, and unto Philadelphia, and unto Laodicea. And I turned to see the oh, voice. He turned. Yes. He turned to see who was talking to him. He turned to see God. Oh, Jesus. He turned to see the Alpha, the Omega, mm. the beginning and the end. Yeah. And when he turned, he turned and what happened? And being turned, I saw seven golden candlesticks. Read right on. And in the midst of the seven candlesticks, one like unto the Son of Man. He saw something like the Son of Man. Yes. So Son of Man is the spirit of the matter, mm -hmm. which came down from heaven. When the Son of Man came from heaven, it didn't have a body. Now the, John is seeing the Son of Man after ascending back to heaven with immortality. And when he turned, he's about to see immortal. Yes, Read. one like unto the Son of Man. Why is it like the Son of Man? It's like unto the Son of Man because the Son of Man is eternal. Now John about to see the immortal body, which is eternal. Oh, so Jesus the body God. is like unto the Son of Man now. Amen. Hmm? Yes. Hold that. What is that? First Timothy 117. What it says. Now unto the king eternal. That's the same Jesus. Amen. Same Jesus. Mm. Now unto king eternal. Immortal. What is he? Immortal. What is he? Immortal. He wasn't immortal. Now unto the king of eternal. Amen. Eternal. Immortal. Immortal. Mean now. He wasn't at first. Right. Before Jesus came here, he was not the immortal God. He didn't have an immortality, people, I say, did not right. come from heaven. Right. Immortality came from the dead. Right. And Jesus got it. Yes, sir. He brought it here. Yes, sir. And then after bringing it here, he showed it to the apostles. And after showing it to the apostles, he ascended it on high. Right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Huh? Yes. Read. Immortal. Yeah. Invisible. Yeah. The only wise God. Immortal. Amen. Invisible. The only wise God. Who? Amen. Be honor and glory forever and ever. Amen. Uh, our Savior. That's who he is. Yes. Hmm? Savior. Right. Our Savior. Titus. Two. One and two. Titus one and two. Amen. What it says. In hope of eternal life. In hope. My God of immortality. That's what it's talking about. Yes. When it says in hope of eternal life. Yes. It's talking about in hope of immortality. Huh? Yes. In hope of what? Eternal life. My God in hope of immortality. Because mm. if you, only way you're going to have eternal life, brothers and sisters. Yes. If they get immortality. Yes, sir. Read it again. In hope, in hope of eternal life, in hope of eternal life, which God, which who, God, which who, which God, which who, which God, what that cannot lie, did what, promised before the world began. So God promised this thing, right? My yes. God, before the world began. Yes, He did. Who's that? Christ Jesus. Christ Jesus promised this thing. Yes, before the world began. Amen. Not Jesus Christ, but Christ Jesus. See, Christ Jesus is before the flesh, and Jesus Christ is after the flesh. Right. Hold that and give me 2 Timothy mm -hmm. 1 and 9. We're going to link 2 Timothy 1 and 9 with that Titus you got 1 and 2. Then we're going to take 2 Timothy 1 and 10 and link it with, link it with Titus 2 and 3. Amen. You follow what I'm saying? Amen. What 1 and 9 say? Amen. Amen. Who hath saved us? What? 
who hath saved us shall will save me later. Who hath saved us? So have yes. Who have saved us and called us with an holy calling and called us, my God, with the holy calling. See, Amen. If you don't have a holy calling, you can't come. Right. Hmm. Read on. Amen. Not according to our works, mm -hmm. but according to his own purpose and grace, which was given us in Christ Jesus before the world began. Somebody say in and of don't matter. <laughs> mm -hmm. All you had before the world begun is in. It's the truth. In Christ Jesus. Yeah. What? Before the world before begun. Before the world begun. Now take me back began. to Titus 1 and 2. Amen. What, what Titus 1 and 2 says. In hope what? of eternal life, uh -huh. which God. That's Christ Jesus. Yes. That what? That cannot lie. He can't lie. Promised before the world began. Uh -huh. Oh, see that. So Christ Jesus, which is God. Yes, sir. Promised before the world begun. Amen. You don't have Jesus Christ. Listen here. You couldn't have Jesus Christ before Christ because you put Jesus Christ. Listen here. Listen, listen. Let's get this real play. Yes, sir. Let's take my time on this one. Yes, sir. You can't say Jesus Christ, Christ Jesus any way you want. No. You can't do that. Mm -mm. You got Christ, then Jesus. Mm -hmm. Why I say that? They didn't know who Jesus was. Before Jesus came, they didn't have the name Jesus. Right. But they had Christ. Mm -hmm. they, my God, they say Christ was with them in the wilderness. Right. Who? Christ. Then we found out who? Jesus. Because he's right, Christ Jesus. Amen. But if you put Jesus Christ, then you say they knew who Jesus was in the Christ was in the wilderness. Right. Mm -hmm. If you put Jesus, the name Jesus, before Christ, Amen. you got them know Jesus Christ before he was manifest. Amen. Can you follow what I just said? Yeah. I'm gonna say it again. If you say Christ, Jesus, Jesus Christ don't matter, wasn't they waiting on the name? Yes, sir. Amen. Am I right? Mm -hmm. They were waiting on it, correct? Yes. So they mean it wasn't given. Right. So it was Christ. And Jesus was hid from them. Yes. Am I right? Amen. Yeah. Am I right? Yes, sir. But when he came, he brought it. Am I right? Then what you have? Jesus Christ. <laughs> Am I right? Amen. Yes. You can't get Jesus before Christ until after the manifestation. Amen. Right. You can't get the name Jesus until after he got him. Amen. Hmm? Right. What did that say? Matthews 1, 21. Is that 121? His name should be called Jesus. Christ Jesus. Jesus Christ don't matter. That's a lie. Mm. Shade even don't mm. matter. No. Christ is before the flesh. Right. Right? Yes. When he was manifested, then you got Jesus, who is the Christ. Right. You understand that? Yes. What is that? And shall bring forth a son. Go up a little bit more. Amen. But while he thought on these things, yeah. behold, the angel of the Lord appeared unto him in a dream, saying, Joseph, thou son of David, fear not to take unto thee Mary thy wife. For that which is conceived in her is of the Holy Ghost. And she shall bring forth a son. And thou shalt call his name Jesus. All right. You didn't got Jesus before that. No, sir. No. Sure you got Jesus before that. No, sir. There's no Jesus before that. Amen. Amen. Lord, have mercy. Right? Amen. Right. So you got Christ. Yes. Mm -hmm. Who is Christ? Christ Jesus. Yes. Amen. Am I right? Yes. Take me back to Timothy. Amen. 1 and 9. Who hath saved us. Who hath saved us. And called us with that holy calling. Uh-huh. Not according to our works. Yeah. But according to his own purpose and grace, which was given us in Christ Jesus before the world began. What Christ Jesus mean? Before manifestation. Yes. Amen. Before he got here. Before he put on the body. Amen. But as now, hold on, take me back to t Titus. I want to get Titus 1 and 3. Amen. You finish Titus 1 and 2? Mm -hmm. Give me Titus 1 and 3. Amen. But hath in due time manifested his word through preaching. Hold on, in due time. 
has manifested his word, which is the name. Yes. Mm -hmm. His name is called the Call, word of God. Yeah, right. Amen. Right. Having due time manifested what? His. Amen. His word through preaching. So what was manifested? Through mm -hmm. preaching. The name. Same. Yeah. All the miracles. Mm. In the glorious gospel. Amen. Amen. That's what it took to save us. The name. Yes. All the miracles. Yes, sir. And the glorious gospel. Amen. And that came through manifestation. Yes. But at in due time, Peace. manifested his word through preaching. Through what? Through preaching, which is committed unto me according to the commandment of God, our Savior. So you can't preach this thing unless it's committed unto you. Amen. That's the truth. You can't pick up a book, call yourself preaching. No. It got to be committed unto you. Right. Mm hmm. Understood. Amen. What it says? Amen. But hath in due times manifested his word through preaching, right on. which is committed unto me according to the commandment of God, our Savior. God is my Savior, which is Jesus Christ. Yes. God my Savior? Yes. According to who? Amen. God my Savior? Yes. Drop down the 12th word for Titus. What it says? Waiting for what? 2 and 12. 2 and 12. Amen. Teaching us that denying ungodliness and worldly lusts, we should live soberly, righteously, and godly in this present world, looking for that blessed hope and the glorious appearing of the great God and our Savior, Jesus Christ. <laughs> that seems like that should just settle it. Right. It's like that should just settle the case. Mm -hmm. hmm? oh. It's like everybody should say Jesus Christ is the great God and our Savior. Amen. Amen. Mm. Mm -hmm. See, like it should end right there, don't it? Yes. But you know someone going to say, my God got a God? Oh, Jesus. Somebody going to say, my God got a God. Yeah. My God got a God. Yeah. That's what they say. Yep. That's that was the fella say. down in Alabama say. He said, my God got a God. <laughs> but if that's true, if my God got a God, wouldn't his God be my God too? So which God would I serve? <laughs> Amen. 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 Oh, Jesus. Wouldn't that be two masters? Yes. yes. Can't serve him. Yeah. Amen. You can't serve two masters. No, sir. No. Man, come up with two gods and think he got revelation. Man, not long people been saying it was two gods, three gods. Yeah. Hmm? That's what Jeremiah had the problem with them with. Jeremiah uh, 11 and 7. Jeremiah was, they call him the weeping prophet. What it says, Jeremiah, he had a problem with that. 11 and 7, I believe I want. What it says? Hey. For I earnestly protested unto your fathers in the day that I brought them up out of the land of Egypt. Uh -huh. Even unto this day, rising early and protesting, saying, Obey my voice. Yet they obeyed not. <laughs> no one climbed their ears, but walked every one in the imagination of their evil heart. Therefore, I will bring upon them all the words of this covenant, Read. which is commanded them to do, but they did them not. I, the Lord, said unto me, and the Lord said unto me, a conspiracy is found among the men of Judah and among the inhabitants of Jerusalem. See here, read on. They are turned back to their iniquities of their forefathers, which refused to hear my words. Read. And they went after other gods. With an S. Yes, other gods to serve them. That, this isn't new. It sure isn't. The whole problem the Lord had with Israel and Judah. And they went after other gods to serve them. My God got a God. That's creating a God. Oh, Jesus. I know how to count. My God got a God. That's two gods. Two. Yes. Amen. Amen. Lord Jesus Christ. Read on. The house of Israel and the house of Judah have broken 
my covenant which I made with their fathers. Therefore, thus saith the Lord, behold, I will bring evil upon them, which see, they shall not be able to escape. See, heaven ever guards now the evil is hell, damnation throughout eternity. Oh, Jesus. You mess around and die trying to serve two gods, you're going to be punished throughout eternity for that. Mm. There is but one God. Amen. Amen. My God got a God. And <laughs> folks, heathens. That's right. Anytime you want more than one God, you're a heathen. Right. Amen. What is a heathen? An unbeliever that there's but one God. Oh, have mercy. Heathens, I say. Yes. One God, one God, one God. Yes. You don't know what one means? Amen. Read on. What else did Jeremiah say? Keep reading. Amen. And... Though they shall cry unto me, I will not hearken unto them. <laughs> you mess around with the other gods, God won't even hear you. Lord Jesus. Read on. Then shall the cities of Judah and inhabitants of Jerusalem go and cry unto the gods unto whom they offer incense. Who you, incense mean your prayers. Yeah. To whom you pray to, you go to them. But they shall not save them at, at all in the time of their trouble. See, the way my God got a God theory goes, somebody's weak. Yeah. That's true. Somebody's weak. Amen. My God got a God. Mm. What the other God need with the other God? Lord Jesus. What does the other God have need of the other God? Mm. Somebody ain't all powerful. Right. My God got a God, somebody lacking power. Amen. Mm. Amen. Lord, have mercy. Amen. My God got a God. Mm. My God don't need a God. Amen. 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 I say, my God, glory Amen. to God. Amen. Amen. Don't Amen. need a God. Amen. 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 See, that's how you're supposed to come with this. Amen. Amen. And you know, people mad. That seems like you should say, Amen. That's right, right? People mad as I don't know what it is. Just what I just said. Yeah. Yes, sir. Because they want two gods. The heathens want two gods. Yes. And they mad I want. See, they know I ain't going nowhere. That's I've right. been doing this too long. That's the truth. Too long. That's the law. Now they're afraid to death. This thing about to break loose somewhere. Yeah. That's what they're worried about now. Because yeah. they know the rascal's not going to stop. Right. You've been doing it too long. Yeah. With all the haters. Amen. You've been doing it too long. Amen. With, Amen. Without the support of others. He's Amen. still kicking in there. Won't stop. Amen. That's right. Amen. That's true. Amen. And he's getting deeper and deeper in the mess he's preaching. Yes, sir. Amen. It's getting more and more light that I don't like. <laughs> Amen. Oh, have mercy. My God don't need a God. Amen. 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 To my God, God of God. Well, the God that got a God is a weak God. <laughs> Amen. 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 He's talking about Jesus got a God. That's what he's talking about. Yeah. That's when he, he said, said my God got a God, he said Jesus got a God. He don't understand what that means. Mm. If I knock you out with this fist, Elder Mary, <laughs> this fist got a God. And I'm it. Amen. Yes. It ain't no two. Amen. It's one. That's Amen. right. My fist got a boss. Amen. Amen. That's right. Amen. Amen. Mm, that's right. Oh, huh? Jesus. Say my fist got a boss. Right. It ain't no two. Mm -mm. Amen. No. Lord have mercy. Amen. I say my fist got a boss. Well, after I hit you, you may see two. <laughs> But there's only one. Amen. Mm. Right. Amen. The Son of Man is the hand of God. Amen. Mm. Ain't but one God. That's right. One. Keep reading what Jeremiah said. What he says. Amen. For according to the number of, the, of thy cities were thy gods. Oh, good. Did you just say that for real? For according to the number of thy cities 
were thy gods. Israel had gods for every city. Yes. Lord Jesus. See, this ain't nothing new. Read that again. For according to the number of thy cities were thy gods. Oh, Having a God is just like a man that can't stay with one woman. That's right. Ain't no difference. If your wife goes mess with someone else, you don't want her doing that. Right. So why would God want to have another God? Mm. Right. You wouldn't want your wife dangling, dangling around with another man. Right. Come on. My man got a man. You don't want that. My man got a man. That sounds crazy, don't it? Yeah. Hmm? Oh, Jesus. Glory to Jesus. God. Huh? That's right. Don't make sense, do it? No, sir. It don't. Israel has city, a God for every city. Now, you know. What is, read that again. Amen. For according to the number of thy cities were thy gods. Mm. Israel was some wicked folks. They couldn't help themselves because they had the law of Moses to show them how sinful they were. Mm. Read on. O oh, Judah. O oh, Judah. And according to the number of the streets of Jerusalem, have ye set up altars to that Almighty. shameful thing, even altars to burn incense unto Baal. Another God. Mm. Right. That's my God got a God. That's another God. Yes. yes. You bell worshiper. That's all he is, is a bell worshiper. Mm. Therefore, pray not thou for this people. Pray for, pray for Elder Mary. Lord. Therefore, pray not thou for this people. No, pray for them that down in Alabama. Therefore, pray not thou for this people. You should be praying for them, not talking about them. Pray not thou for this people. Amen. 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 Neither lift up a cry or prayer for them. Ah. Amen. Neither lift up a cry or prayer for them. For See. I will not hear them in the time that they cry unto me for their trouble. I'm not wasting my prayer. God ain't going to hear me. Jesus Christ. Man. I ain't going to waste my prayer. Amen. Lord have mercy. Yeah. Wow. Amen. I'm that raw thing. Yeah. Whew. Mm -hmm. This is why he don't want to see me. That's exactly why. Amen. He don't want to see me. He go in the corner with his little peons and talk about me. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I don't care how many you got. Makes me no difference. Can you find that in uh, uh, Kings? I think the fifth chapter of Second Kings. When uh, uh, we done with this other stuff? Yeah, you can let all that go. <laughs> <laughs> um, where uh, Elisha was with the Syrian king, I believe I want 2 Kings 6th chapter from correct, if it ain't 6th chapter I'm almost certain it's 5th chapter go ahead and then get it and bring it out for me you see it? just go to read some of it, I think it's 6th chapter when the Syrian king he didn't like the fact you got it? He didn't like the fact that Syria, all his plans was being given up. And no matter what the Syrian king done, Elisha kept telling all the secrets of the Syrian king plans upon his bedchamber. Elisha knew him. Mm -hmm. What it says? Let's start at the sixth verse. What chapter? Six and six. Six and six? What it says. And the man of God said, Yeah. Where fell it? And he showed him the place. And he cut down his stick and cast it in thither. What happened was they were working. And a piece of steel got lost. Mm -hmm. And it fell in the water. And when the steel fell in the water, the man had borrowed it. Now you borrow someone else's equipment. Mm -hmm. See, back then people would return what they borrowed. People was real loyal. If you got something from you, you had to give it back. So while he was working with someone else's equipment, that, that, 
that still fell off the axe mm -hmm. and fell in the water. So when it fell in the water, they couldn't find it. Right. So here come the man of God, going to find the steel. Look, the steel fell in the water, and he's going to find it. Read. And the iron. No, no, no. Read all of it now. Don't jump. And the man of God said, where fell it? And he shewed him the place, and he cut down a stick and cast it in thither. Oh, so the man of God go gets a stick. Yeah. And put it in the water. Yeah. Boom. Watch what happens. And the iron did swim. The iron went to swimming back to the stick. You know, that ain't, that's something there, right? The, the oh, iron Jesus. swum. The <laughs> iron did swim. <laughs> Good God of my. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, Lord Jesus. One God. See, you don't get no two gods there. No. No. Elijah wasn't talking to no two gods. No, no sir. Come on, man. They, come on. You only need one God to work. Amen. Amen. What do you need two for? Somebody weak. That's the truth. You got two gods, somebody's weak. That's yes. Truth, amen. Hmm? Amen. Two is better than one. <laughs> That's what they think, right? <laughs> when you're dealing with flesh. But one is sufficient enough when amen. you're dealing with God. Amen. 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 Mm? I say two is better than one. When dealing with flesh. Yeah. Hmm? For one fall, he has the other one to help you up. Yes, sir. But when you're dealing with God, Amen. One, God. Amen. one is efficient enough. Because what did he say? With men it may be impossible. But with, God. but with God, all things are possible. Yes, sir. You take your two men, all things ain't possible. But with the one God, all things are possible. Amen. Huh? Read. Therefore said he. Yeah, what did he say? Take it up to thee. Take it up to thee. And he put out his hand and took it. Then the king of Syria. I thought, did you skip a part? I thought something in there said he said it was borrowed. Mm -hmm. That was the fifth verse. We, yeah. we started at the sixth verse. Yeah, yeah, yeah. what the fifth verse says. But as one was falling, failing a beam. The axe head fell into the well, water. One was what? What you say, huh? But as one was failing, what the word are you saying there? That one was one was what? But as one was failing a beam, failing a beam, failing. Yeah, that's yeah, failing. <laughs> that's what it says. As one was failing a beam, go ahead. The axe head fell into the water. And he cried and said, Alas, master, for it was borrowed. <laughs> See, it wasn't his. Right. Glory to God. Now jump on down where you was at. Eighth verse. What is that? Then the king of Syria warred against Israel uh -huh. and took counsel with his servant, saying, In such and such a place shall be my camp. See, look at this. So Syria took counsel with his men. It was like, you know what? We're going to camp over here, and this is going to be our camp. Read. Mm -hmm. And the man of God sent unto the king of Israel, saying, Beware, thou hast passed not such a place, for thither the Syrians are come down. So Elisha will go tell Israel what Syria was up to. Yeah. Now, you know, this could make the Syrian king mad. Yes, Read, sir. keep going. And the king of Israel sent to the place which the man of God told him and warned him of and saved himself there. He escaped. Not he once nor twice. But what? Therefore, the heart of the king of Syria was so troubled for this thing. So now the king of Syria is mad. He's mad. He's like, hold on now. I got me a spy in the camp. <laughs> yeah. How in the world, every time I'm going to do something, the king of Israel know my moves. Mm -hmm. How he know my moves? Right. Who's telling him my moves? Read on. And he called his servants yeah. and said unto them, yeah. will ye not show me which of us is for the king of Israel? Which one of you all is a snitch? <laughs> he Boy. called all, the king of Syria got all his men and said, look, which one of you all the snitch? Right. That's what he want to know. Who's snitching? Who's snitching Go on taking my plans 
the king of Syria, yeah. and running over there to the king of Israel and telling them my moves. And one of his servants said, none, my lord. One of the servants king. talked to the king of Israel, king of Syria, said, look, man, it ain't none of us. Ain't no, we all are loyal. Read. None, my lord, O king, but Elijah. Hold on. I'm going to tell you how this is happening, king of Syria. King of Syria, this is how it's happening. You know that prophet Elijah? The prophet that is in Israel? The prophet that, that prophet Elijah, the one that's in Israel? Tell the king of Israel the words that thou speakest in thy bedchamber. <laughs> so when you secretly talking, <laughs> Elijah is telling the king of Israel your secrets oh, mm. upon your bedchamber. Yes, sir. No matter how private you get, Elijah's telling it. He's not even here. Read on. And he said, go and spy where he is. Go get that Elisha now. <laughs> that I may send and fetch him. That I may fetch him. Bring him over here. Read. And it was told him saying, behold, he is in Dothan. Oh, I found where Elijah at. Yes. <laughs> Amen. He's in Dothan. Now Elijah didn't have no large crowd with him. Elijah had no many people following him. Matter of fact, Israel didn't even want to listen to him. Right. Hmm? Read on. Therefore sent he thither horses and chariots and a great host. Horses, chariots, and a great host. And they came by night and compassed the city about. Yeah. And when the servants of the man of when the servant of the man of God was risen early and gone forth, behold, and host compassed the city both with horses and chariots, and his servants said unto him, Alas, my master, how shall we do? Now when he gets up before Elijah and see a host of army all around about them, mm. he, will, he go runs back to Elijah and says, Elijah, my, pro, my, my, my master, how what am I going to do? What are we going to do? Right, amen. And he answered, fear not. For they that be with us are more than they that be with them. Now, to, now Elijah, Elisha is telling this young man, don't you be afraid of all these horses, all these chariots, mm. all these soldiers, because they be more with us than be with them. Now, to the young man, he's looking at, what are you talking about? Mm. It's just me and you here. Just me and you. Read on. And Elisha prayed and said, Lord, I pray thee, open his eyes. Some folks need their eyes open. Yeah. They think flesh is a strong arm. Yeah. They think the multitude of people mean something. Mm -hmm. When all flesh is as grass. Amen. Yeah. Lord Jesus Christ. Yeah. That's the yeah. truth, man. How are you counting flesh? Open hold your on, eyes. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Open your eyes. How are you counting flesh? Right. Lord, have mercy. Okay, okay. How are you getting flesh in the number? When do flesh adds up? Mm. Mm. When does flesh become part of the number? Oh, when all flesh. Oh, My Christ. God is as grass. That's the truth, That's man. Right. Ain't none of it Amen. no good. Amen. No, sir. Mm. Amen. Lord Jesus. Lord, open their eyes. That he Bless may the see. Bless eyes, my Lord, that they may see. Lord. Yes. That flesh don't mean nothing. Amen. Amen. Don't let Amen. the fleshly number cripple them, Lord. Bless their eyes. Amen. Bless their eyes, my God, that they may see. Amen. That what? Read. And the Lord opened the eyes of the young man, and he saw. Oh, my God. He didn't see no flesh. No, sir. Nope. When God opened his eyes, my God, he didn't see no flesh. Mm. My God, when God opened your eyes, my God, you will see there be more be with us than them, and it's not Amen. flesh. That's right. Amen. Jesus mm. Christ. That's right. If God be Amen. you, who then could be against you? Amen. Hmm? Amen. We are more than conquerors with him. Right. Hmm? Oh, Open their eyes that they may see. Bless his eyes. And God did that. Read. And he saw, and behold, 
The mountain was full of horses and chariots of fire round about Elijah. The mountains, glory to God, was full. Full of what? Horses and chariots. Horses and chariots. Of fire. Of what? Of fire. Of what? Of fire. Of what? Of fire round about Elisha. Amen. Mm. So who's on the Lord's side? Hmm? Who's on the Lord's side? Amen. Amen. See, what just happened there, you saw who was on the Lord's side. Right. Amen. The Lord's side has nothing to do with flesh and blood. Amen. Amen. Oh, Jesus. Amen. 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 Huh? Amen. I say the Lord's side Amen. has nothing mm. to do with flesh and blood. So when that wicked prophet Geno Jennings Wicked prophet. No but flesh with all your hypocrites. That's right. You rejoiced in it. Yeah. You were glad in it. But you're not on the Lord's side. Amen. Huh? Amen. That's the truth. I see you rejoiced. Yeah. And we're glad in it. But you're not on the Lord's side. Amen. I'm that prophet that God sent. To reveal the son of man. Amen. And ain't no man walking. Amen. Can do anything with me. Because the book is finished now. And I'll beat you to death with what's written. Huh? Amen. Amen. Yes, sir. Amen. 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 I'll beat you to death with what's written. Amen. Bless the Lord. Glory to God. Amen. Hmm. You care about your imagination, all your gods you didn't create it? Right. Amen. Lord have mercy. Huh? Amen. When you talk flesh, you're not on the Lord's side. Mm. Lord, I mercy. say when you talk flesh, you're not on the Lord's side. When God True. blessed the servant of Elisha and his eyes was open. Mm -hmm. And the Lord opened the eyes of the young man and he saw. He didn't see no flesh. No, sir. No. That's why Elijah was able to go wherever he wanted to go. Amen. Without a bodyguard. This rascal, this old pink squeak, pink squeak, good bodyguards. Yeah. And they're going to lie to me and debate anybody. How you debate anybody and you got like, it's like a going to a pool and you need a lifeguard because you can't swim. <laughs> That's the truth, man. Well, ask you to tell me to debate anybody. How? When you got security, Amen. right? Amen. You can't find no prophet with security. Amen. That's the truth. Amen. What kind of prophet needs security? Amen. <laughs> Lord Jesus. Amen. Mm. I say, what kind of prophet? Oh, mm. Need security. They know you're a punk. Amen. All day long. Right. You pick on folks that do know nothing. Right. You're a punk. Mm. Mm -hmm. That's right. Come this way. Amen. I snatch everything you thought you had. Amen. Right. Oh, Lord. Hmm? Amen. Amen. And it'd be more with us than be with you. Amen. Yes. That's right. Behold, the mountain was full of horses and chariots of fire round about Elisha. He used to preach no weapon form against me a prosper. <laughs> he used to preach that. Oh. Hmm? Now that weapons may prosper against me, I need a bodyguard. Yeah. <laughs> right. They're going to use his wife. His wife is off limits. I respect that. I mean, his wife is off limits. I respect a man's wife. Mm -hmm. But I'm saying he used that to say why he got security. Mm -hmm. Someone may have done some, something like that. Point blank, I'm telling you, is that no man of God right. has ever, right. ever walked around with security. What a man of God needs security when reading again. Amen. And behold, the mountain 
was full of horses and chariots of fire round about Elijah. What's round about you? Mm. <laughs> Bluefish. Security. Bluefish. Lord Jesus Christ. Bluefish. Mm. Every one of your securities is blowfish. Right. right. Full of air. Right. Oh, Jesus. And they dumb enough to do it. Mm. You know, anytime you got men being your security, them some weak, they, they half faggot. Because <laughs> ain't nowhere in the world we walk around securing a man, calling himself a man of God. No, sir. Who does that? Who does that? Bless the Lord, man. Gino's a, that's one line, that's one line rascal. Terrible, man. How in the world you gonna call yourself a man of God and you got security? Looking like Farrakhan. Mm -hmm. I can understand why Farrakhan got security because he run his mouth and he ain't no man of God. Right. I respect that. Farrakhan ain't no man of God. Nah. Farrakhan's a politician. He's a politic. He plays politics. Politician. That's what he is. That's why he has his security. Yes. The people that he support supports him. Mm -hmm. I That's support God. God support me. Amen. Right. Amen. 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 That is true. Hmm? Amen. What man of God ever was in Israel, any prophet in Israel, carried an entourage? Didn't a liar go to say he takes no thought when he preach? And people believe that. Gino whole process is played, recorded, planned. Yeah. William breaks down everything and hands it to Gino. Say, so how are you going to say that? How are you dare going to say that William writes down? William is the scholar. Gino is the one that does all the hollering. William's a scholar. Gino makes you holler. Yeah. I say, William writes down everything. You say, well, how? What make, listen here. He, Gino told you William does it. He, he told you that, man, let me put my words plainly so I'll be misunderstood. Gino plainly told you that he writes stuff down and pre plans it. He took there and put a statue of Mary in there. You want to tell me you didn't take no thought? You had a statue sitting on the podium. Mm. That was planned. Yes. You didn't had women mannequins and men mannequins. Yes. That was planned. A picture of Jesus. Yes. That was planned. Right. So how do you take no thought? Well, amen. How you take no thought? You, you had to take thought to do that. Right. Yes, sir. Yep. You had a whole stage planned. Yes. Then you're going to tell me you take no thought. It's just the Holy Ghost. Give it to me. That's a lie. <laughs> no, sir. You planned it. Yeah, right. Amen. Mm. Amen. Oh, I'm just stupid. I, I mean, I, I didn't see what I saw. You had a mannequin's. You had statues. You had, I think someone had shoes before, right? You had shoes. Body bags. Body bags. He, that's called showtime. Yeah. Mm -hmm. When you have a show, you plan it. Mm -hmm. Premeditated. Premeditation. Yes, sir. So don't tell me you don't take no thought. Amen. Mm. Amen. And if you would do that mm. on a green branch, mm. what you going to do on the dry one? If you do that in the open, what you doing secretly? Right. If you will come and plan out the whole thing on the platform, what are you planning secretly? Oh, Jesus. Amen. Bless the Lord. If you were playing all that on a green branch. What you doing on a dry branch? Right. Mm. You got more planning going on. Your whole movement is a plan. 
Huh? Amen. That's the truth, man. You get rid of them bodyguards and come see me. That's what you do. You get rid of them bodyguards and come see me. Amen. He got people think he'll debate anybody. People stupid enough to believe that. Yeah. They stupid. If you want, you go there and debate them. Now, come on now. How do I look stupid? Do I look dumb? I'm going to waste all my time, my gas, to go all the way out there for him to say no. Right. Have you ever seen him debate anybody that walks in there that know anything? No, sir. Never! This man debate homosexuals, yeah. rappers, what else? People that don't know nothing. He never would touch the apostolic faith from where he stole everything from. Right. Mm -hmm. Take me back to my scriptures. Second what it Kings. says right there where you was at? Do what? Second Kings uh, 6 and 18. What it says? And when they came down to him, Elijah prayed unto the Lord and said, Smite this people, I pray thee, with blindness. <laughs> and he smote them with blindness. See, when you got God according on to your the side, word of Elijah. You, don't need a body, you don't need a body God. You don't need no body God. See, this real talk here. Amen. Smite this people, I pray thee, with blindness. No, go call my security. <laughs> Lord Jesus. Get my security. Smite this people, I pray thee, with blindness. Security! Smite these people, I pray thee, with blindness. And he smote them with blindness, according to the word of Elisha. Good. See, the man of God is supposed to have a word to speak it. Yes, sir. Hmm? You can't touch him. Huh? He'll hide you. If not that, God will hide you. And if it's, meant, if it's for you to be slain, die then. Right. Huh? Amen. What's wrong with dying? What's wrong with dying? If, of all, of, of, if we have of this hope, only we have all most men miserable. We have a hope beyond the grave. Amen. Uh, that's where our hope's supposed to be at. Read on. That's right. Amen. And Elijah said unto them, this is not the way. Neither is this the city. Well, the, the rascals was blind. They didn't even know how to go nowhere. Lord Jesus. Messing with Elijah, Elijah blind all the rascals. Mm. And the servants saw all that was back of Elijah. Elisha. Read on. Follow me, and I will bring you to the man whom ye seek. Read on. But he led them to Samaria. <laughs> Read on. And it came to pass when they were come into Samaria that Elisha said, Lord, Open the eyes of these men. Good God, that's some power. That there. they may see. Blinded them, then turned around and opened their eyes. Read on. And the Lord opened their eyes and they saw. And behold, they were in the midst of Samaria. And the king of Israel said unto Elisha, when he saw, when he saw them, my father, shall I smite them? Shall I smite them? And he answered, thou shalt not smite them. What is thou smite those whom thou hast taken captive with the sword of the Lord? With the sword? Open their eyes that they may see. Glory to God. Huh? Amen. Blinding them, then open their eyes back up. Then that's some power there. Amen. Hmm? That's some power there. Huh? Amen. Amen. And, and you're talking about Elijah was camped around about hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of soldiers. You're running from one little gas fight. I mean, I mean, it was this. This was a lot. You're running from what? What was it? I don't know. Some little fight. What are you running from? Hmm? Mm. I ain't ducking or dodging. Right. Bless the Lord. Hmm? My number's up there. Amen. Call me. My number's up there. But I'll tell you right now, and I'm not, I'm not going to the prom dance with you. We're going to the cemetery. Wow. I'll tell you that right now. We're not going to the prom dance. We're not doing all this. We ain't doing none of that. Hmm. Dancing all around scriptures. I'm taking the one scripture and, and take your head off your shoulder. Amen. All I need is one. Right. If you know how to shoot, all you need is one bullet in a gun. You don't need two bullets. 
Amen. All you need is one. One shot, one kill. Yeah. I don't need two bullets. That's right. A man that know how to shoot, he don't need two bullets. Mm -mm. You give a shop, a shopster a gun with a bullet in it, and you're one person, you're done. That's it. That's it. Amen. So no, no, I only got one bullet. That's all you need. You only gonna use one scripture? That's all I need. You ain't worth another bullet. <laughs> <laughs> you need worth that bullet. Amen. You ain't got this only script you're going that you not worth another bullet. Amen. Some ain't worth the bullet. The Lord Jesus. Huh? Amen. You ain't worth the bullet I'm gonna shoot you with. But I gotta kill you, so I'm gonna shoot you with it. Amen. You ain't worth that scripture. You low down trifling rascal. You ain't worth that scripture, you heathen. That's true. The heathen ain't even worth the one scripture I'm a killer with. Mm -mm. I say, you heathen! You're not worth the one scripture I'm going to kill you with. And then your heathen want me to pull out another scripture. For what? The scripture's too precious to me for that. Amen. Amen. I'm just going to use one of them to kill you with. The, the Lord. son of man came from heaven. <laughs> Amen. Amen. And you know you can't get around it. No, sir. Gino then preached the father came down for years because he was twisted up with Johnson gospel and did, stole that, didn't understand it. Right. So now here I come on the scene, God sent. Mm -hmm. He can't even use that. He used to tie rascals up with that. Can't tie me up with it. Because I'm going to make you read the Father came down. Don't tell me God came down because I know the Son is God. Don't you dare try to tell me the Son of God is God because the Son of God is not God. The Son of God was never the Son. The Son of God was the body that the Son was in. Amen. The Amen. eternal Son that told, Lord, Father, glorify me with the glory we had before the world Amen. begun. Amen. Amen. What Son is that? The dear Son. Yeah. Amen. By him which all things were made. Amen. Mm, the Son right. of God wasn't the dear Son. No. Talk too much for you. I wrap circles around you. <laughs> huh? Amen. And then I have scripture. I'm twisting in circles. And in scripture, I'm going to knock you upside the head. Twisting around you. That's how boxes do. You really know how to box? Oh, man. You'll go swing one place. They got a little way to go. They know how to twist their feet. That's mm -hmm. how they do you. You swing and they, they steady going around you like that. <laughs> you swinging over there and they wrapping around you. Amen. Hmm? All right, heathens, I got one shot, one kill. Come Amen. get the million dollars if you're there. Amen. I got one million dollars. Chapter and verse for the Son of God and the right hand of God. Son of God came from heaven, and to add to your folly, the Father came down. Show me scripture. Show me chapter. And while you're at it, give me verse. Amen. Bless the Lord. Consider what I say in the Lord God. Give you understanding of all things. Till next time, farewell. Amen.